video we're going to show you how to install the bee fan. It's really simple, it goes in quick, and it's not really that difficult. Even a child can do it. So what, we're ha what we have here is we have the fan, we have the base, and we have the top, which is adjustable to whatever size bed you have. These tabs are used to hold the top in place depending on which size your bed is. So with that said, we'll show you how to install the bee fan. You ready, Izzy? Yes, sir. All right, here we go. The bee fan is really simple to install. Just pull back your comforter, then untuck your top sheet. The fan sits between the top sheet and the bottom sheet. The higher the thread count on your sheets, the better it will work. The bee fan can be installed in two different ways. You can put it under the bed, or you can turn it around and have it pointing outwards. For this installation, we're going to put it under the bed. Plug it in. We've already ran the power cord for it, so just plug it in and then set it at the foot of the bed where you're going to use it. The next thing you want to do is set the height of the top section. And in order to do that, you just slide it down onto the base and then adjust it to where it's either just touching the top of the mattress or a little bit above it. Once you have that set, take a pencil and just mark it where the bottom is going to be. With that marked, you can take the top off and set your tabs. These tabs will not only hold the top in place, but it also stretches the top just a bit and helps to uh, close that air gap. Set the tabs, put the top on, and then just slide it down. And it's set. After this, you'll put your top sheet back on. Tuck it in nice and tight around the fan. And put your comforter back over. Now once you have the B fan set up, you'll turn it on and you'll notice that it has plenty of airflow and plenty of air pressure to actually lift the comforter up off the bed. Now you can adjust it to whatever speed you need for your own comfort level. So Izzy asked me if it would be strong enough to lift her toy horse off the bed. I told her, of course. So we gave it a try. And as you can see, the bee fan has plenty of static pressure and plenty of airflow to lift the toy horse straight up. It's gentle yet strong. So if you're a hot sleeper for any reason, or if you're just looking to save on your electric bill, this fan is for you.